I think we are now, uh, after COVID, we are again in a new type of crisis uh, due to uh, energy prices, inflation, uh, largely due uh, to the, the, the war in, uh, in Ukraine. And we see that all member states uh, develop uh, programs uh, to help the citizens, households, but also their companies. And talking about companies and workers, because we see that due to uh, uh, the increasing prices, there are a certain number of sectors suffering a lot from uh, this increase in energy prices. In Italy, for instance, uh, ceramics, which is one of your very famous industry, high quality industry, Italian ceramics are worldwide, worldwide known. Well, they, uh, they suffer because they need a lot of, uh, a, a lot of energy and the energy prices have skyrocketed. And therefore, I think to create some uh, uh, level playing field in the European Union, uh, uh, we, we, there is the, some need for uh, an European uh, program. As we had during the uh, crisis, we have the uh, recovery and resilience, but we are sure. So there is a debate: uh, how how should such a program be developed? Uh, the Commission is reflecting on this. There is a risk of fragmentation in the, in the internal market. Those who can uh, help and support and subsidize uh, their industries, uh, their companies, and those who can at least less do that. And this would create new kinds of imbalances. So we certainly have to reflect if we do not need a new instrument at European level.